Hello, hello, hello. I am back with Hogwarts Legacy. Previously, I was streaming this game and, um, my PC could not handle it. It was a lot going on. Um, this game uses up a lot of, like, RAM, I think is what it is. And, yeah, my PC couldn't handle it. It was just like, um... I'm gonna crash now so I've decided to kind of make it a let's play but kind of also treat it like a stream ish where I'm not gonna be cutting like a lot or doing a lot of edits or anything so yeah I became a Slytherin as you can see the the snake symbol on my chest I've been told that that means that I'm a bully I guess I I don't know I don't know anything about Harry Potter or anything like that so I I also found out that I possibly made my character a guy because I chose wizard and I wasn't sure if like which versus wizard was like supposed to be a gendered thing so I think I don't know I chose like a I chose a female, like, um, preset, and I think she has, like, I think, yeah, she has, like, a whatever, but I'm a wizard, so, you know, there's that. That's cool. So, here is my little dorm room. It's super cute. Um, look at my nice white hair, all fluffy and stuff. Super cute. Um, I've got freckles on my face. Can I zoom in on that? I designed a very adorable character, I feel like. You can't really see her. She doesn't want to look at the camera. She's very camera shy, clearly. <laughs> but so far, I'm really enjoying this game, actually. I kind of like it. And I made a point in the in the stream to say, like, hey, if I like this game, if I enjoy this game, I will watch Harry Potter for the first time. <laughs> I, I have been convinced, or not convinced, but pressured into watching that movie series and reading the books for a long time and I've always rejected it just because it's never been like my vibe really. I've always like seen it and I'm just like, yeah, it looks like it would be good, you know, I'm not saying it's bad, but you know, I was more of a Percy Jackson kind of person. That was the series that I was obsessed with when it came out. So. I have my class chosen, Slytherin, because you know, they like power and they have ambition and drive and stuff and I'm like, I relate to that, so I suppose some introductions are in order. If that makes me a bully, I, uh, it really sucks, but you know, anyways, so yeah. There's a bowl of cashews, delicious. <laughs> Hi, hello. I need to introduce myself to people. Oh, oh, wait, what's this? Cool. Can I attack people? Oh wait, I think I already tried that before. And I could, I don't want to do that. Okay. <laughs> this is so fun. Sebastian Salo. Hello. Can I help you? Why are you being mean? Oh, Look at, oh. you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Salo. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs. Who She's got double scars on her eyebrows. Still <laughs> impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. Oh, did our did that other guy die? Is that what happened? Okay, I I I thought maybe like he could have like also teleported somewhere else. I didn't know that. Um. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I guess we've lost someone already in the story, so it was terrifying, it was exciting. I, will, I think it was exciting. It was dreadful, certainly, but quite an experience nonetheless. Interesting perspective. Okay, that sounds really How wrong. How did you and Fig okay. manage to escape? I it's maybe I shouldn't have said exciting. Learn, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. Uh, what are you reading? What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough, but not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. What do you mean by that? Some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts. Which ones? Seems I may have met a kindred spirit. Ha <laughs> ha! 
That is a conversation for another time. Okay. It was good meeting mysterious. you. Good luck today. Thank you. All right. Cool. So obviously, it kind of makes sense that they'd have some spells they wouldn't want people to know about. So if Sebastian and I get into a little bit of trouble learning forbidden spells, then I mean, I'm done for the adventure. And I hope these like all these reading options. Oh my god. Oh 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 oh, 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 oh. okay okay I'm sorry that was so terrifying oh my god. I just like to explore you know. But um. I don't know about demigods. Hopefully. Hopefully. I put my hand up and said we had a griffin come by our street once and tried to get our rabbit. My sister had to run out after it, throwing stones till it flew off. I thought Howen would be impressed, but honestly, glare. She said you never meddle with dangerous beasts. If you ask me, she's the dangerous beast. Uh huh. Professor Interesting story. Fascinating oh. stories about growing up in Uganda. Okay, I think they're just gonna keep talking. Um. Anyways, I was. I keep getting distracted. I was saying, hopefully, choices don't uh, make like a huge that, difference yeah. in this game because. You know that would kind of suck if I make bad choices and make people think I'm like a psychopath. Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. That's Hit not me. the way I was standing. Told you. Hello, you I'm just staring at me? you. Ah, oh, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day. Taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm a Melda, oh, by the way. Sure. Shame yeah, I wasn't sorry. with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills in a broom are legendary. I'm sure you would have died, probably. I wish you had been there. We had it handled. Okay, I don't want to make a bad character, but I mean, I'm confident, right? I'm confident. We had we it handled. handled it. And I think you're underestimating the nature of a dragon. A broom would have been kindling. <laughs> Not the way I fly. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach oh, you more what's than her Pagala accent? ever could. Oh my god, Speaking her of accent. Speaking of I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Do you fly a lot? Do she sounds like a master fly flyer. School? I make the time. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Okay. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? Ah, I see. She's a bit of a Goodbye, genius. Goodbye, Imelda. Nice meeting you. She sounds a little... what? Is that Scottish? Maybe? Hopefully I... Hopefully people aren't like cringing at my attempts at accents. Oh, that's cool. A half-eaten apple. Clean up your messes, please. Oh. Ominous gaunt. Nothing yet. I, I think I heard one. Hmm. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Mermaids. Oh, based on Is he blind? When you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. Mm-hmm. A little bit. I do like to make an well, entrance. Well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> you're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here, though I doubt you'll need it. Did you suspect you'd be in Slytherin? Do mermaids often appear outside the common room? Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. <laughs> well, okay. Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin. One of the four founders of Hogwarts. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was mm. obsessed with blood status. A pure blood maniac. 
Unfortunately, oh, most yikes. of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Yikes. Well, uh, hopefully I, I know how to encounter people Thank like you, that. <laughs> Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. Is the new fifth mm -hmm. year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Who's talking to me? And no, no, I'm not in here. Maybe I'm talking to people. I did notice that my um, audio, the audio, my vocals are kind of weird. They kind of sound like robotic a little bit. Oh gosh, oh gosh, she sprints, she sprints. Ah, I'm losing where I am. Oh, hi. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Yeah. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Oh, don't you Especially worry. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Mm. Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much oh, discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical the Education of the Ministry, we've devised the... something extraordinary to ensure your success. Yeah. Okay. Here you are. My hands are dirty. Oh. Wow, okay. Oh crap. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. Okay. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Oh. Do we like Thank have you, our Professor, own pocket dimension where we can just put things on track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Okay, okay. This there's, way. Oh, there's so much going on. I want to like take in the environment, but everything's moving so fast. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. I don't want to steal. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Okay. I can't move any faster, so I'm sorry. You're gonna have to just bear with me here. Oh shoot! The guide I forgot will give about you that. Opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. As a goddess, I have a feeling that I will Do catch on up. very quickly. I am right here. Everyone, so you mean. cast Revelio on that statue and see what details the inside can provide. Okay. Okay. Oh, on this statue. Collect information. This statue depicts Kelpie, a shape-shifting water demon native to Ireland and Great Britain, which usually takes the form of a long-maned horse. The largest Kelpie ever reported is a Loch Ness monster in Scotland. I see. You've just unlocked a field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appear here. Wait, what just happened? My pro- okay. The field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience. Our XP are the only way. Okay. Okay. Oh wow, there's- this is a lot. Okay. This is your wizarding level XP. Continue earning from challenges increase- Challenges increases your level and power. Okay. Oh gosh, okay. Okay, so all of these things uh, help my level or just challenges help my level? I think it's just challenges, right? Okay, um, collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category. New challenge cate new challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Okay, this is a lot. Okay, collect and find filled guide pages in Hogwarts. Okay. I, I've done that. Okay. Okay. Um. 
Okay. Clever, isn't it? Keep yes, I open think. Keep your eyes for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Okay. I will try my best. I am slightly confused and overwhelmed, but I am sure that I will be able to keep up. Um, okay. Oh, chest. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field Blue guide flames. contains a okay. map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Okay, open up map. Cool. I guess I'll have to use M for that because my remote wasn't working. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live and includes the house, common rooms, and the Great Hall. Okay. The select Grand Staircase region to continue. Okay. Grand Staircase. Okay. Um, in this view, you can see blue flames available in that region. Okay, so that's like fast travel, right? Gray blue flames reveal location of undiscovered flames. Green, you discovered it. Okay. Annex next. Okay. Okay. Use. Rotate the map and fast travel to the central hall of flooping. Okay. Sheesh. This is so much information. I mean, it's pretty standard stuff. It's just like their version of basic things like fast traveling and keeping a, I guess, and here a we log. Are. Quite the time uh, saver. Here. These stairs lead directly to central hall. Okay, oh my god. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. But I want to look around. This painting was moving. Oh, he's moving. That's so cool. Oh, they're all moving. That's really cool. Off on another adventure, are we? I just want to like explore a little bit. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. You're no fun. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. Okay, you'll be you expected just want to, to come right here. Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. Okay. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Okay, what's Hogsmeade? You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. Okay. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. That's You will cool. also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Okay. What exactly is defense against the dark arts? I mean, that's pretty obvious, Can but I'll ask anyway. about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. Mm -hmm. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become auras. auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Okay. Tell me more about charms class. What will I learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes. All terribly useful. I think you will enjoy terribly Professor useful. Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard. And a talented teacher. Thank, Thank you, you, Professor. Professor a lot to absorb on your first day. And you have much to learn. Happily, yeah, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Okay. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, yes. Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. 
Hmm. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Yeah, Professor is, um... Hmm. He has his reasons, I'm sure, right? I mean, I don't know, actually. It is kind of weird. Wait. Should I tell the truth, or...? Professor was being kind of weird about all of everything that happened. I don't know if I can trust him entirely yet, but also, I don't know if he maybe has good reasons as to why certain things happened. Hmm. Now that I'm thinking back at the intro of the game, there was a lot going on. I'll tell her the truth. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to Maybe I shouldn't have said anything. I don't know. I'm a snitch. Speak I'm sorry. Devil. Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh, they yes. probably were. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with Yikes. a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. I don't know Very about well. that. Enough uh, it was kind of convenient, I honestly. Myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? That of landing course. was very convenient as well. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. I will, will I will. Valuable to you. Relax, and lady. Invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll oh, explain God. more so much about those assignments I mentioned. And Wait, we'll what see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. Supplies. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, jeez, there's so much happening. Okay, I just want to like take a second and just like. Just like say like hi to people like hello hi, my name's Ray. I'm the new student here. Hello. Oh, he he's, he is not happy about me getting in his face. Okay, hello. Hey, I talked to you earlier, didn't I? No, he doesn't know me. Okay, cool. Hi, hello. Hello. Sorry, I don't mean to bump into you guys. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm new here. I'm kind of awkward. Um. Okay, I'm running away now. Hi, hello. Wait a second. That looks like the same guy. Okay. What are you? Wait. Oh, okay, 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 I'm sorry. Sheesh, this game doesn't want me to explore. Okay. Hello. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. I'm sure you did. did. I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? Why are you questioning me? Why are you questioning me? She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. But why are we yes, holding well, it back? Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. Maybe... <sighs> it was right to keep the details to yourself for now. I guess. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It Maybe he told me to keep it a secret at some point and I forgot. With your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, uh -huh. why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? We Unfold have to do it that and right have a look. I... There's so much happening! You can track available map quests from the map. Okay, cool. 
cool. Oh gosh, so much. Okay, this represents main quest. Completing main quest will further the story, unlock new features, and grant XP. Okay, cool. Uh, some quests are locked by spell and or level requirement. Okay, new spells can be earned by completing professor assignments or as quest reports. Cool. Track quest. X to continue. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. The map is I'm enchanted to help you find your way. Cool. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds you like really you've have quite to tell a day ahead, but... what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade oh for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. Oh God, He's an exceptional craftsman like and there. a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For okay. now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More yes, than your hours may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. <laughs> Okay, I'm not trying to complain about the game, but I just feel like they're just throwing so much at me right now. <sighs> it's like, it's like giving me anxiety. That's like one thing about open world games that I personally don't like sometimes is that they just throw like a bunch at you and I'm just like, my brain, maybe it's just me, but like, I have a very hard time focusing and like keeping up with like a lot of things, you know, because you know, I am a goddess with ADHD. <laughs> and sometimes when a open world game is just like throwing, like pelting you with like information constantly and from every which way, I'm just like, oh, wait, hold on. I still am trying to remember like the first thing. So it's more of a me problem. Did he just move? Yeah, he's alive. <laughs> What the heck? Hey, I talked to you and to you. I've talked to both of your twin brothers over there. That's pretty cool. I if I like Professor Weasley or Professor Hecat more. Hecat. No, Weasley. Oh, they're both hmm. brilliant. But anyways, I'm not like saying that this game is like this game is bad or anything like that. I'm just simply saying like sometimes open world games are hard for me because like they just pelt you with information and like there's so much on the screen and everything's happening and I can't keep up with like the dialogue that the characters are saying and all the words and tutorials that are showing up on the screen and like keeping up with like the story hints and cues that they're trying to tell me about meanwhile trying to like you know understand how to play the game and all that stuff so it's not like a problem with the game it's just a problem with my brain sometimes can't handle it like you know some games like uh Elden Ring for example I feel like it was very minimalist and you just kind of like figured it out slowly on your own or as you played and that was great but like not all open world games are like that right like I've played a lot of open world games and Oh, hello. That's very pretty. <laughs> How nice to see oh. you, my young friend. What? Who said that? Who's talking to me? Are the paintings talking? Okay. Weird. Okay, so... I have so many things that they told me I need to do, and I don't remember a not on one of them. Possibly be oh. As difficult as it seems. oh, okay. Oh, hi. Hello. I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks balmy. I'm potty. Oh. But it's this painting. I don't know. I never these noticed words it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Is this a side quest? Have you learned anything about it? Are there other paintings like this? Are there other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. Mm -hmm. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. Mm -hmm. Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. I see. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. 
Okay. Lumos. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Okay. That does seem like it's very nearby. Why didn't she think of Wish going to do that? I see the students here aren't very bright. Oh my gosh. Whoa, I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, okay. Whoops. I dropped all of those bugs. Is there fall damage? Oh, I... There is. Okay, that's fair. Sorry, excuse me. Oh wait, is it telling me the location of <laughs> Okay, cool. This looks like the location from the painting. What Spoilers. So it just it? told me where to go. It didn't tell me. Okay. Lumos. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. My frames, my frames, oh my gosh. This game is not ready to be played, I don't think. At least, I don't know. Maybe I'm the only one having issues. Maybe it's just my PC, but... <laughs> I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Okay. Cool. So I played with some settings. And I'm hoping that you don't really see much of a difference um, and that it still looks good. It's still using a lot of my memory for some reason. I don't know what I can do about that until I guess they optimize it for PC. So this is how it looks right now and I'm just going to continue what I was in the middle of doing. Which was solving that puzzle for that girl, which is she's up here. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. It doesn't look that bad. You did? Yeah, I think How? it still looks fine. A little bit. I followed the clues. I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving it. You didn't even you try. You for solving riddles. Uh, Natty's good at that, too. So is Meat, although he does tend to over-explain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth! I should have seen that! I agree. <laughs> the fact that you didn't see that is kind of concerning. Oh, whoa, 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 I'm level two. Oh, shoot. Okay. Um. I still don't know how the leveling system works that well, but. Mm, where do I need to go? Nice to see you, my young friend. Oh my god, she is talking. You're weird. How do I? Potato. Oh, how do I? Revelio. Wait. How do I use my? Do I just do it from the map? Oh, I see. So I don't have it. I don't have any of these unlocked. Okay. So I have to go there first. In order to unlock it. Okay, let's go. Go in the class. Honestly, if school was if school was like this, I think that people would love to go. What the heck? Whoa! What the heck? Hi. Oh my god. I forgot I take fall damage. Oh, I can actually go out here. Okay. My god, the frames. What are these? Can I eat them? No. It's really beautiful despite all of the terrible frames and oh my god it looks so bad i swear the game actually does look really good despite me messing with the settings to be able to play it oh 
Okay. Oh, so I unlocked one of these. You can't now. imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. So you're like, um, you're like probably like dead, and this is like a little memorialization of her and how she invented flu powder to help people fast travel. Thank you very much. She seems irritated <laughs> by him. Okay. These thirst traps of these people is kind of... <laughs> oh! My god. This place is so cool. No wonder people like Harry Potter. <gasps> Hello, kitty! Oh, you're so pretty. Look at those stripes. Hello. Do I get a cat? Can I get a pet cat? Whoa. What kind of meow was that? I'm just looking over here and it looks so bad. Everything's moving so terribly. I really am sorry about all of the stuttering that's, that's going on here. I don't really know what to do and it kind of saddens me a little bit because I really want to play this game and like share it with you guys but it's just, it's just, it's just not the best quality right now. And I don't want to like wait forever. Oh. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Some of us don't necessarily want him to get back to the lesson. I just talked to you. They reuse a lot of NPCs in this game. But it's not a big deal, I guess, you know, if I can't talk to them, but... Like, these guys are the exact same face. It's like Genshin Impact. Oh! Oh! Where? Oh, hello! You're even prettier than the last one. You have white hair just like me. Oh. They sound so weird. Oh my god, you're even prettier than the last one. Oh my god, I want you. Can I please tell me I can have a pet cat, please? Oh my god. You guys sound really weird, but otherwise, very cute. Okay. And then the werewolves join the goblins in the uprising. So much talking reveal. In the goblin rebellion. Zero three five question mark. The Unicorn twelve question mark question mark four. Interesting. That's a puzzle for sure. Oh, it's that guy. Hey, Willy Wonka. Nice peeves. It was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. It was Basil Flat. Ooh, fight, fight! It's a bold attack. He looks scary. The minister of Boot or the minister of Black. Stop it, Peeves! You'll get us in trouble. In trouble you will be, but you can't. What's happening? She says it's a boot, and he says it's okay. a bag. Okay. <laughs> I just got taller. You'll get a Question mark. Oh, and you're both wrong anyway. It was okay. Hephaestus Gore. It wasn't boots, and it wasn't black. But you're all in trouble with Professor Black. <laughs> uh huh. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, why is it still? <laughs> it was rolling from over there. Okay. Oh god. I'm too dumb to figure out this puzzle. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay. So the question mark, I have to guess what it is, okay, wait, no, is there another level lock, okay, hmm, I'll come back to you, let's go to class, I have stalled long enough. All right, let's start class. 
Oh gosh. Oh gosh, okay. It just struggles a little at first. That's here. okay, it's fine, right? Behind you. There is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Yes. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of chant. Now, oh, okay. this will be a crucial year yes, in your buoyant. education on the art Our of charismatic. charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right? Okay. Now, I everyone, like this guy. please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Uh -oh. I must know. Anyone? Oh. Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. But I'm new here. Mm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Uh, yeah, mm. totally. Uh, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get Pop into quiz. pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Okay, okay. This is fun. Okay, what are we about to do? Oh crap, okay, it's time to learn. Okay. Charm. Acacio. Accio. Accio. I don't know where I added those extra letters for. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot oh, of potential, you. but remember, Potential is nothing without practice. Ah, Keep at it. Seriously? Obviously. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Oh, rival. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. Ooh, that sounds After fun. Me. Let's go. Wait, nobody else did that. Did the spell? Was I the only one capable of doing the spell? <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> yes. So, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test? Oh, I almost right? picked your hairstyle. <laughs> Very cute. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's this? <laughs> so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Oh, okay, okay, hmm? sure, yeah, totally. Uh, Just put me on the spot. <sighs> okay, what am I doing? Explain the rules. Very simply, cast out. You are summoning them toward you. The trick is to pull the sphere as far as possible, but not a bit more, or it'll fall, yes? Okay. Now, I could keep talking about theory all day, but practice is the best, Professor. Okay. Show us how it's done. I'm nervous. Okay. Hold R2. This one pulls the target closer to the caster. Hold R2 to press the sign button to the cast and pull a target closer. Release R2 to cease casting spell. Okay. Excellent control there. Oh, okay. That's it. Okay, nice. Not bad. I like that I can like. Splendid. Oh, okay. <laughs> I can just do a little like a cool little spin. Yeah. Very good. Points I'm a to Slytherin. I'm a natural. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss sure, Onai, yeah. would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? 
Oh no. Is she gonna automatically do better than me? Oh, okay. Just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Okay, okay. Yes, All right, let's do this. Is there like a distance, a draw distance? Ah, uh, she just walked right through me. Okay. Oh, and she just walks off. Okay, I get it. Sassy, yes. style, class, personality. Oh, that was a little much. Okay. Excellent control there. Thank you. Oh, Natsia, come on. That is how it's done. Is it? Oh gosh, watch this. Oh my god, no. Oh pff. I pulled off way too quickly. Whoopsie. Oh gosh, that's okay. Can I retry? I was I was a little too confident and I can't see what I'm doing now. Oh no! Oh Not gosh. Too can I retry? Can I retry? Can I retry? Can I retry? Oh my god, that's so embarrassing. Um, well then. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? That was just a practice round. Practice round! Oh gosh, what's he about to do? <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. Yeah. <laughs> I'll say. Okay. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. I kind of wish I could have gotten this her accent. Settles it all. Watch Honestly. this. Okay. All right. Natural. Natural. Yes. I too would like to take from the middle. Yes. No. Don't lose your composure. Oh, I've lost my composure. It's all gone. It's out the door. She's so much better than me. Oh my god. You know, I'm new here. There we go. Okay. Okay, okay. That's it. I can make a comeback. I can make an epic Let comeback. Oh, you idiot! Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Wait for it. Woo! <gasps> okay! Oh no! Okay, okay. I thought it rolled off. Alright. Alright, that's one point for each of us. Nice, nice. Very good, both of you. Well done. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Oh, it's okay. Took we both weeks won. To become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Thank you. I'm glad you understand. Let's be nice. That's Let's be good nice. to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. How big is Uganda? What does Uganda look like? Is their magic the same? Um, is magic this the may same? This an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. Interesting. I wonder why we use a wand. Surely the magic is weaker. That's incredible. Is the magic weaker? I feel like, I mean, I don't know. It depends on the lore, I guess. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Mm -hmm. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. 
Yeah, I must that admit, makes however, sense. that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. It is very dramatic. <gasps> is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? It addresses Wagadu. mountains of the moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me, this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. I love her voice. I could like listen to it all day. Is Wagadu much oh bigger God. than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. <laughs> but it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. Good. Thank you for telling it's me. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank yeah. you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Okay. Of course, I really wish you I can could... use Aki on humans. If you're so inclined. Oh, well, you'd be okay. using it on clothing. I can talk to you. After my brother learned the summoning charm, it was oh. constant. A word of if you will. Oh, wait. Oh, re okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hello. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed I the match. Both Miss won. Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> mm. Now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Okay. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Awesome. Everyone's got something special they want me to do. I am no regular student, am I? I am the main character of this universe. Yeah, I wish I could fix the fact that I gave her double slits on her eyebrows because... I don't know, it looks like kind of like, um... It's not symmetrical. Like one is, they're both slanted the same direction, so I don't know. I think it's kind of funny looking. Hey, you look like Harry Professor Potter. Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom, but a bit mad. Oh, and he walks away from me. That's fair. I would be wondering why a strange girl like me would be talking to you too. That's a level locked. Interesting. Okay. Let's go. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Hello. You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. I didn't already You're talk the student to you. everyone's been whispering about. Hope I'm your first day's going well. With these faces. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. That's kind of you to I'm say. Unfortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. That's well, how it usually better is. better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Mm -hmm. It's tradition in my family to play a game. Okay. Um. I know I'm kind of a dumb dumb. Oh. But I wonder if I can figure this puzzle out really quick. That's pointed up. This is pointed down. Reveal. Down. And up. The question. Three, five, zero. Three, five, zero. Three, zero, two. So maybe it's unicorn? Wait, because that's one, two, right? So maybe it's unicorn? Is there not a unicorn here? Okay, so maybe it's two on the other side. So let's make it tarantula. Okay, and then that one's four, twelve, unicorn, double question mark, which I don't understand. Um, twelve, four, 
Not unicorn again. Let's see. Where's that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's make it that. Hmm. Er. Hmm. Okay. Maybe it's just supposed to be question mark, question mark, you know. Hmm. Err, I'm too dumb for this. Okay, on to the next quest. Off on another adventure, are we? Yes. So much talking, everyone's talking. Stop talking. I'm just kidding. Rude. Where's the water? <laughs> Whoa. Hello. Revenia. No, that doesn't do anything for you. Okay. So I have luminous and Lumos. No. How do I open you? <gasps> Are you... This is a puzzle? I don't know. No reflections. Level one lock. I don't have the skills. How do I get downstairs? Whoa. Where am I? Attend defense against the dark arts. I don't know how to get there. It's downstairs, but there's no stairs. Unless I just jump. What are you up to now? Don't worry about it, lady. Oh, um, okay. Look at these. You guys are weird. Oh my god. 
Okay. 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 Get him. Get him. Sebastian Salo, your face is everywhere. Professor Hackett! Oh. Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, Yikes. but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Jeez Louise, now, kids. You may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. Knowledge. Or... Okay, a cape. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso. Just hit Billy. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? Drop them. Throw them across One the room. One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Mm -hmm. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Okay, I'm ready. I like her cage. She's my favorite teacher so far already. Okay, here we go. Learning a new spell. Oh, he's catching up. Levioso. All right. Ooh. What happens if I fail? Do they shame me? Now, let's try something a little larger. Okay. Main character time. Here we go. Let us begin with a basic. See how okay. the dummy deflected your cast. Oh, this time, okay, I get cast it. I get Levioso it. first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Good. Now the basic cast. Well, get out of here. <laughs> Bam, bam, pow. Bam. Look at that. He can't handle it. He's so surprised. Ugh. Very good. But yeah. the best way to practice is by dueling. All right. And we'll start with you two. Duelists, take your marks. So All right. Look at that girl with the glasses. Now, She's so sharp. I want a fair duel. Using oh. Levioso, basic cost, and Protego. You may begin. Okay, hold on. I forgot how to use these magics. Hold on. This should be easy. Wait, how do I have Protega? Good form. I know. Get out of here. Nothing lucky about it. This can't be a perfect Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Okay, hold on. How do I do? I forgot how to do. How do I do for t um Protego again? I've totally Not forgot. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> Thank you. Everyone's got freckles here. Hey, hey, no flirting, okay? No flirting under my watch. Points to Focus on school kids. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. Mm -hmm. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, In the real or world as is ever different. more likely goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Yes. Understood, Professor. So. I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, sure. well done today. I shall reach I need to out practice. soon with additional assignments. I forgot. I think I kind of like got beginner's luck again with that one. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Okay, okay. 
Oh. I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. Imelda. Okay, I want to practice. Oh. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way around. Yes. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. Hmm. Okay, so I have Luminous, or Lumos, Accio, which brings things to me, Levitate, Levioso, Revelio. What? Hello. This large dragon skeleton that hangs in the defense against the dark arts classroom is allegedly a trophy taken by Professor Hecate after she single-handedly defeated one of the largest poaching rings in eastern Wales. During the Great Poacher Raid of 1878, she is old. Hello. You're cool. Okay, so... Where's my Protego spell? Protego. Oh, triangle. Okay. Okay. Okay, I've got it figured out. A lot of buttons, but I'm sure I'll understand. Nice work. Thank you. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. it yeah, I destroyed you. Practice. practice. Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't yeah. expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then yeah, again, you know. perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Um, let's see, do we destroy him or do we humble him? It was. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. <laughs> be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know. Mm -hmm. I'm not you him. might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Oh, that sounds fancy. Sounds suspicious. Sounds intriguing. It sounds intriguing. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret Listen, I am all for breaking the rules. Or sneaking into the restricted section of the library. You just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Exactly. Please, Sebastian, I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look oh, for Luke and Brattleby near skill. the clock tower okay. entrance. If you're interested. Okay. Next time. There's a lot going on. I have a lot of side quests to do. Fun. And I like how I'm developing my character. She's a little sassy, a little, a little cocky, a little arrogant, a little charismatic, a little ambitious, a little. Yeah. Hello. You drilled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. Thank you. Now, what's my main quest? There's gotta be like a quicker way to get to my map. Okay. Meet with Professor Weasley. When do I get to have my dragon that I can fly on? Wait, no. I don't want that. The gloves are edgy. Neckwear. No, I'm not a fan. Wait. <gasps> Ooh, I could go without the robe. <laughs> My PJs. Okay. Alright. I changed my outfit so I could stand out a little more. Everyone's wearing these capes and robes. Well, I'm too good for that. 
I am the chosen one after all. Though she does kind of look a little weird without it. Oh well, we're gonna go with it. And I'm also wearing gloves because I'm itchy. Not sure he's in at the present moment, the headmaster. We'll be sure to tell him how very much you despise him. Fills our stone hearts with joy to be in the presence of such arrogance. Who's talking? Hello. Oh, Revelio, right? Revelio. This painting depicts a young Arnford wizard, Ilios, who famously saved his entire village from an army of Dementors and Dark Wizard Raxidian by conjuring a mouse protease. Sure, sure. I can't remember the last time Sebastian lost a duel. Huh. Yeah, well. I hope he's used to it. Um... How do I get to that? Might as well be surrounded by Jarvis. Oh, so you are the one talking. Okay. Wait. Okay. Get a snot on your nose. Cute. I don't know why, but it is. Okay. Whoa. Poison? No? Nothing? What is this? Hmm. Are you gonna react? No? Interesting. <gasps> Forest rivet gloves. Sure, why not? Oh yeah, those those have the style. That's cool. I'm lost. This place is so big. Hello. Hmm. You're quite cute. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Sebastian swallows? Oh. 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 So much magic in this place. Alright. Meet with Weasley after class. What about the room, Professor? Excuse, Deke. <laughs> ah! There you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard Not as bad. much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Hmm. No, Professor, I hasn't. Professor Fig said anything. Exactly. Why are you coming to me with your questions? Shouldn't you already have your answers? Hmm. I don't know. Let's have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training. He continues to be reticent about the details. Mm -hmm. Mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. Mm -hmm. I see. Mm -hmm. Like trying to get a sonnet from a Streela. Regardless, yeah, totally. you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Um... Yeah, more assignments. He didn't mention that. 
Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first. The textures on her now, coat look really nice. Regarding the trip nice. to Hogsmeade, or, I mentioned earlier. Uh, blazer. We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, oh, Professor. Nice. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Yes, I am ready. What more can you tell me about the potion shop? What's a spellcraft? Can you tell me more about the potion shop, Professor? J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Professor okay. Sharp asked that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. Oh, really? Is it because I'm so special? I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. Oh, is there a transmog? There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. All right, I'm ready. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. Exciting. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Shh. Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. How so? How, wait, can I question about? Can I? Can I question that? How? How would you know? You've have you been watching me? See, all these professors are kind of sus. Not gonna lie, I don't trust the fact that all these professors are asking questions, being dodgy, and then also like keeping an eye on me. Hmm. Who do I want to see? How about Nat? I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most she talented She has a nice students. voice. I will, like, and she knows soon. the area. She'll keep you well Listen clear to of any of Victor the nice Rookwood's voice undesirables me around. en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. All Once right. you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. A butterbeer? Sounds exciting! Alright. I just stole some money. Speak to Professor Ronan and receive your first assignment. Assignments are the types of quests given you by Hogwarts professors that will complete it or you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mending Charm Reparo, or Reparo, which is required to complete other quests. You can track assignments and their progress in the quest menu of your field guide. Cool! There's so much to remember. So many names, so many so many quests, so many characters. I'm sure I will eventually be able to keep up with them. Oh. Is that um an Alice in Wonderland reference? Maybe or no, probably not. Wait, wasn't that Mad Hatter a rap? But no, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. Never mind. Okay. Transfiguration Courtyard. <sighs> ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes Repero. things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Mm, cool. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. 
A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Ropero in no time. Awesome. Okay. What's the purpose of this Why task? Why must I first complete tasks to learn Ropero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience. Okay. And these tasks should provide you with just that. Makes Such sense. experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. All right. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Collect flying plates near the broken statue. Collect flying plates page in the... Okay. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. I wonder where the flying page is. <gasps> How do I collect it? Do I just... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. So... Maybe I should... Wait. Nope. Wrong button. There we go. Pretty cool. Okay. Now to go upstairs. If only a new student were to help me with my sad predicament. Oh. Zenobia and Noak. I feel like you're talking about me. Why are you so tiny? Are you alright? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia and Oak. The girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. Um. Uh... Why does everyone hate you? Everyone hates you? Why? Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst, mm -hmm. that no talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone Aww. collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. That sounds awful. <laughs> I haven't much interest in a game that sprays you with odors. Only yeah. if you lose, which I never do. Or at least, not often. <sighs> People mm -hmm. can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. I mean, it's their fault for playing Imelda with you, the if they know losers. that's the consequences. Ever written a story or a terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. Just use, uh, Akio. 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 Ah, let's think they're overreacting. Oh, rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. Anyway. I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone she's like a 12. selfless why are they and talented her? fifth year to help me. That's probably why she's so tiny. Duh, she's like probably a fucking freaking ninth grader. Haven't you any friends at school? Not really. Natty said hello once, but not a word since. Oh. Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones down from their hiding spots? If I knew that, I'd get them myself. Whoever hid my gobstones that high got Just up there somehow. Just give me some information. Okay. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. Aw, poor girl. Maybe you should find a different game that other people would like to play with you. Oh, there's the other page. But here. Brilliant. Oh, I'm level three, didn't even notice. Oh, I've I'd got like to the keep final an eye page. on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. That's true. High places around the school. Okay. I'll remember to keep a lookout. See, the game doesn't look that bad, right? It looks pretty decent, I feel like. I trust the preliminary tasks weren't too much trouble. It was so easy. I completed the assignments, Professor. 
Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old you. lending <laughs> charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Yes. Papa. Raparo. 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 New spell unlocked. Raparo. The mending charm could be used to mend broken objects in the environment. That's it! Very good! If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. I see. Okay. Rebellion. The Wyvern Fountain. Is a transfer in a courtyard has a likeness of the Wyvern on the on top and serves as a relaxing place for students to gather despite rumors to the contrary. Possible started by Sir Cadigon. This is most assuredly not meant to be the Wyvern of Y slain by the lively knight of spite himself. Pretty cool. We better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Is her gobstone around? Why do you keep saying that? I don't see anything. I'm probably missing it. It's probably right in my face and I've looked right past it. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Why haven't anyone else? Oh gosh. Actually, can I break this? I can. Oh my god, are you okay? Yeah, you know, I I agree with that student. I'm gonna leave that broken. <laughs> Interesting. I never feel fear. Oh my well, god, are you ninth graders? So cute! She'd fallen over in Piccadilly Circle. Oh my god, there's a tiny. Hello, looking for me? Yes, I am actually. Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. Oh, wow. Hogsmeade. She's gonna cry. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me it's to so accompany you. Really? Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a butterbee in the village. Yeah. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. Wow. Ah, I cannot tell you how nice it is so to pretty. breathe fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. Wait, wait, I hold believe on. you. I just have to see it in better settings. Though I suppose you would not really call it elective when your mother was the oh one my who elected that you to take it. Way better. Oh my god. Wow, the difference between medium and high is insane. Now my computer's definitely not gonna work. <laughs> Just while I'm outside, I want to see. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. 
everyone it will sure tell is. you to visit at Christmas. But that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. Tell me about Not it. Not much for the cold, are you? I hate the cold. Oh, I do not mind the cold so much, but it has taken some getting used to. I did not grow up around snow. Yeah, I like to see snow from the inside. Oh, wait. Even oh, though wait, space yeah. itself is cold. You I know? often spot lace with there flies are warm in these areas. areas. Oh, what's so special about them? They are interesting to look at, but if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Oh. Lace wing flies. <gasps> what the world? <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. This world is great. <laughs> Can I collect this? Did I collect it? Moonstone. Cool. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Did I collect it? Okay. Sorry about that. Whoa. Look. From the forbidden forest. Hippogriffs. I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs oh. had been spotted nearby. Oh. Very cool if I could. Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs. Absolutely. Could he handle it properly? That's the forbidden forest on the left. It's off limits to students. As the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Right. Wow. There's Hogsmeade over the crest. Past that ruin. Forbidden only makes it more alluring. Okay, okay. I knew that was coming. I'll come to you yet, Forbidden Forest. Alright, off to Hogsmeade. I would spend all of my time exploring if I could. I confess Same. I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the uh, area, since you're relatively new here. Leaping mushrooms. That? So cool. Mm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. Yeah. For sure. I agree. I'm just gonna collect all these things just because I feel like it's probably gonna be necessary at some point to have them. How are you settling in? I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything mm. was so new and unfamiliar. It's I'm a lot. Used to things. It's a lot what about for you? sure. Do you finally feel settled? I still miss my home, but it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully That's it will good. for you too. I think so. I think I'm really going to like this place. Even if I can't see it properly. Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Huh? Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh -huh. um, you might want to turn back, Miss on I. Uh, turn and run. Oh, is, is he drunk? Right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What uh -huh. did Mr. Moon? Jemmy, guys, Dougley and Arian, mm, terrifying. 
I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. All right. Poor Mr. Moon. Don't go. Did he, guys? I think he had too much fun in the village. Yeah. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. Nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. Okay. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank you. Sounds good. Ooh. Look, everyone. Okay, we're getting more diverse NPC models. And here we are. These two it is guys hard are to know where to start. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter beer, and you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. Good. I'm just gonna stare at this character until my frames come back. Not happening, I see. Oh gosh, the chop. It looks good on my PC, but... Professor Weasley said that you need to that get pushed on. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore okay, a little as well. Wants to get a new Experience wand. Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Oh my Enjoy god. Enjoy yourself. I will see you soon. Okay, so I'm just recording a quick outro because um, this game is literally so stuttery and laggy that my recordings have broken up into honestly like 10 separate parts. I don't know what's going on. I've adjusted settings everywhere I can and I just first- Thank you so much for watching. Bye!